Hey guys, welcome back to Coders Arcade. This is Ashank David, and welcome back to a brand new video of our job prep series, where we talk about different companies. We talk about uh, what are the job roles available in that company, how to crack the job roles, and what are the exams that are held in that company to crack that particular role. Let's uh, start this video, guys. And this video is related to the Code Vita exam that is held in TCS through which students are going into different competitions and hiring as well. So recently I have created this video where I have talked about TCS Code Vita cracking the tag test exam. Now in this video, a lot of a lot of our subscribers, they were asking a lot of different doubts. What exactly is the tag test? Um, I did not get the link for the tag test exams. When I will get the link, I have done round one and round two. How will I crack this? A lot of different doubts they were asking. So in today's video, I want to clear this doubt. And if you haven't watched this particular video, I'll also give the link of this video in the description below as well as in the I button. You can go ahead and watch that video. Now I'll today in this particular video, I'll clear all the doubts related to this video guys and you will be able to understand about what exactly is code Vita. So this video is majorly focusing on to what is code beta exams in TCS and how do you crack it? Um, what ex is the exact process and uh, how do you get the jobs? What is the difference between the competition part and the hiring part? Let's talk about that. Also, recently I have created this video also about TCS NQT. Now TCS NQT is another exam that is held in TCS for the hiring process. A lot of students are confused right now. Uh, what is the difference between NQT and Code Vita? Why TCS conducts Code Vita and why TCS conducts NQT? Should I go into NQT or should I go into Code Vita? This is a huge confusion right now guys and in this video I'll clear all that confusion right away. This video also I have already created and uh, if you haven't watched this video, I'll give the link of this video in the description below so you can go ahead and watch this video as well guys. Now let's come to the main point. Let's talk about Code Vita. Now as I told you right now, there are two different exams. One is TCS NQT and another is TCS Code Vita. Now TCS NQT if we talk about, it is the National Qualifier Test Exam that is held by TCS for the hiring process. So NQT focuses on to majorly hiring process. If you clear this TCS NQT round, then you will get one of the three roles that are available in TCS. The very popular roles, the ninja role, the digital role and the prime role. Now, if you don't know the differences between uh, ninja, prime and digital, I have created this video as well, where I've explained you about what is the uh, difference between ninja, digital and prime. So if you haven't watched this video also, I'll give the link of this video in the description below. So you can go ahead and watch this video as well. Now guys, if we talk about the main context, NQT is used for hiring process. And once you clear this, you will get one of these job roles. That is fine. Now, if we talk about Code Vita, and by the way, before we go into that, uh, recently, as of December 2025, the latest update on NQT exam is that uh, 14th of December is the last date to register for NQT and 25th of the December this month 2025 is the exam date for NQT. So if there is anyone who is interested into going and getting the job into uh, Digital Prime or Ninja, you should go ahead and register. Uh, the last date is on 14th of December. Don't forget that and uh, do uh, give this 25th of December exam which will help you to get the job in TCS. Now, speaking about Code Vita, this is where the main story begins. Uh, currently, Code Vita season 13 is happening right now. And in today's video, let's understand about this. What exactly is Code Vita? So Code Vita is another exam held in TCS through which you can get two things, get into two things. There are two tracks in Code Vita. One is the competition track and another is the hiring process. There are two processes. One is the hiring process and another is the con con contest process. What exactly I'm talking about? Let us see here, guys. So I've created this uh, page for you, but I'll explain you about what exactly is this. If we talk about the timeline, then there are three rounds, guys. One is round one, round two and round three. 
राउंड वन इज अ प्री क्वालिफायर टेस्ट राउंड टू इज अ क्वालिफायर टेस्ट एंड राउंड थ्री इज अ ग्रैंड फिनाले टेस्ट नाउ इन प्री क्वालिफायर वॉट हैपन इज दैट यू सिट फॉर सिक्स आवर्स इट्स एन ऑनलाइन एग्जाम एंड इट इज अनप्रॉक्टेड हियर इफ यू क्लियर दिस राउंड दिस इज दिस इज अ कॉन्टेस्ट बेसिकली राउंड वन राउंड टू राउंड थ्री इज द कॉन्टेस्ट so in the round 1 what happens is that, that if you clear this with a good rank then you go into round 2 and if you clear this also with a good rank with a good score then you go into round 3 then in the round 3 if you clear the round 3 that is the grand finale round and here uh, the prize money you will get as 20000 dollars guys i hope so that this is very very much clear this is the contest part of code vita exam now there is another round called as there is another uh, process also in between of this where you select get selected for hiring also so for that there is a hidden step in between that is called as the tag test a lot of students are confused about what exactly is the tag test let's talk about that so many people think that the tag test is the round 4 tag test is not the round 4 tag test can happen in between of any of the round 1 and or round 2 it can happen just after round 1 or it can happen just after round 2 also now who will be sitting into this tag test who will be eligible for this tag test let's talk about that let's say those people who have uh, cleared the round 1 with good marks with good uh, scores with good rank they can get the tag test uh, link just after the round 1 now what exactly is this tag test tag test is a test where it is a verification uh, test through which tcs verifies that what you have written in the round 1 or maybe round 2 if it is getting connected after the round 2 then tcs will check that the code that you have written in round 1 is that you only that you have really written about that like it's it's really you that you have written this code or not it's a verification round if you clear the tag test then you will be selected for either ninja or digital profile that generally happens after round 1 or maybe round 2 it can happen now for some people tag test can happen just after round 1 and for some students tag test can ha happen after round 2 so if you have done really well in round 1 and if you have not got the tag test uh, uh, link then you should definitely go sit for round 2 if you have done really well in round 2 then you may definitely get the tag test verification round link so that is your about tag test so tag test can happen after round 1 or round 2 depending upon your uh, performance so those people who have not got the tag test link after round 1 don't worry if you have done well just wait you may get the tag test link after the round 2 so definitely it is mandatory to uh, you know sit for round 2 also i hope so that this is very very much clear to all of you guys some students will get tag test link after round 2 so for those people what you have written in round 2 that will be asked in the tag test what really it is checked that if it is you only that you have written the code in the round 2 speaking about the processes both round 1 and round 2 are unproctored basically they are both online first round is for 6 hours online and it is unproctored it's the gate pass round and round 2 is the online 8 hours advanced difficulty decides the global rank basically this is also unproctored only round 2 is also basically unproctored so in both the rounds you uh you are not checked like you can write it according to you can use google also you can use uh, chat gpt also to solve the problem if you have done well in that in those any of those two rounds then you may get the tag test link if you have not done well in the round 1 or round 2 then you will not get the tag test link once you clear the tag test then only you can uh, get the job for ninja or digital this is the whole story guys that runs in code vita i hope so that this is really really well cleared about this understood now ab more details about tag test i have created this video you can go ahead and watch this video guys and i have cleared what how do you exactly how do you exactly crack the tag test okay the road map is given and everything is there
I hope so that this is very, very much clear to all of you. Now, speaking about uh, how do you, okay, so this is how you do. Both after both pre-qualifiers and qualifiers, if your tag test is uh, good, then you will be going for interview. And in that interview, uh, your TCS uh, Ninja or digital roles can be applied. Okay. Now, after this, how do you get the job? The short, the shortest path and the contest route. See, what is the shortcut? The smart hiring. Let me explain. If you performed well in round one or round two, then you will get the invite for the tag test. That is the verification code. And if you clear the tag test, you will directly get the interview call for either Ninja or Digital. This is, I hope so that this is very, very much clear. Now, speaking of the contest route, in the contest route, you are, if you are in the global top 100, then you are invited to grand finale, which will be held in Mumbai. And you will get the prize money that is $20,000 plus TCS prime offer. This is the contest route of getting the job. If you want to get the highest package, the prime package, you have to clear the whole contest. That means round one, round two and then the grand finale. This is the place where very few people will go, but you can go if you have that knowledge. I hope so that this is very, very much clear. Okay. So these are the two routes that are available. So these are some of the questions which were asked by our subscribers, clearing our confusion. Can I get the job just after round one? Yes, you can get the job just after round one. If you get the tag test invite and if you clear it, you'll get the interview immediately. This is clear. Next question. Do I have to give the tag test after every round? No. It usually happens once per candidate. Now for some people, tag test invite may come after round one. And for some people, tag test invite may come after round two. So it really depends. And you have to wait until the round two also gets cleared. If you have not got the tag test link after the round one, you just have to make sure that you have done really well in both round one and round two. I hope so that this is very, very much clear. What if, if I use chat GPT in round one? Danger. You will fail the tag test, the offline test. I'm talking about the tag test. Start practicing blank screen coding right now. So basically you should be knowing how to scratch from the beginning guys. That is all about TCS code Vita process. And I hope so that this video is very, very much clear. If you found this video informative, please do give us a thumbs up. And if you have any doubts, please do let me know in the comment section below so I can clear your doubts as much as possible. I'll try to clear my all your doubts as much as possible. Well, that's all for this video, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Do give us a thumbs up and do like, share and subscribe to our channel Coders Arcade and don't forget to press the bell icon also so that you won't miss any future updates. Also about TCS NQT. One thing I would like to tell you, if you have not cleared any of the TCS code Vita part, let's say for some reason, you have not, you are not able to clear the tag, uh, the, the tag test and you have not cleared the round one and round two if your performance was very bad then you can wait for TCS NQT. You can go ahead and register for NQT also. In NQT, if you crack it, then you will get the job. Either you will get the job as Ninja, Digital or Prime. Regarding the, uh, the TCS NQT updates, 14th of December is the last day to register and 25th of December is the exam date. So I hope so that this is clear. Regarding code beta, round one and round two are already completed. Round three is going to be held approximately in March month in 2026. I hope so that this is also very much clear. Well, that's all for this video, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, that's all for this video, guys. I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care. Until then, bye-bye.